Welcome to my secret math tutor. I'm going to show you how you can convert the logarithm into an exponent. And it basically uses this conversion formula right here. And I've used a, a few specific colors so you can see where the pieces go. So on the left side, this represents the exponent. So a to the power of b is equal to c. And when it gets converted into a log, this becomes log base a of c is equal to b. Okay. So let's see how this is going to work for our example problem. In the example, I have log base 4 of 64. And maybe I'm trying to figure out what the value is. Well, one thing that will help me is actually changing it into an exponent. This is because our brains work a little bit better with exponents than they do with logs. Okay, so let's see where all of the pieces need to go. According to this conversion formula, the base and the logarithm will end up as the base of my exponent. So let's see, I have a base of 4. Let's start off with a base of 4. Okay, whatever this logarithm is equal to, that will end up in the exponent. So 4 to the power of b. Okay, looking good. And this will equal, it looks like what was inside the log is now all by itself, so this will equal a 64. Okay, now when I'm looking at this problem, I think to myself, 4 to what power is actually equal to 64? Okay. Thinking about this for a bit, I know that b must equal 3, because 4 to the third power is actually equal to 64. Okay. Now that will allow me to go back up to my logarithm and say, okay, yeah, yeah, I know what that logarithm is. Log base 4 of 64 is equal to 3. So this conversion formula helps us evaluate some of our logarithms by basically turning them into an, an exponent so that we can finally wrap our minds around them. If you'd like to see some more videos, please visit MySecretMathTutor.com.